the complexity of medicine today um, is such that, I mean, everyone knows it's impossible for the physicians to keep everything in their, mi in their mind at the same time that they need to um, have it available when they take care of patients. That's, you know, that's one of the values of information technology. There may be certain things that physicians need to know automatically without relating to a book, but the reality is so much information changes over time. And as we um, work to provide this external assessment that the boards do as part of our public responsibility, I think matching that as much as possible to the ways in which physicians practice makes a lot of sense. I think there is a certain amount of basic knowledge that a clinician should be able to summon up um, no matter what uh, the latest is. And then there's also the need to have the skills to be able to get the right information in areas where things are changing or where you would normally, in the course of trying to come up with a diagnosis or a treatment plan, be doing some investigating and some research. I would tend uh, to make data sources available to them just as though they would use data sources in their everyday practice. So perhaps the exam should be through an electronic health record that allows them to link out to other sources. I'm sympathetic to the perspective that a lot of clinicians have that in terms of knowledge, the knowledge base that they need um, as clinicians, that today the way they're practicing, they don't actually have to have all that sitting between their ears in the moment of, of sitting with a patient, that they can actually tap into that world of knowledge to inform their decision making as they go. And so somehow enabling us to reflect that into the way we do testing. How effectively actually can they quickly access knowledge that they may not have immediately in their minds, but uh, that they know how to get it. I think there, there is sort of the, the easy way of thinking about this, which says it's not that important the doctors are going to be smart anymore, because what's the point? I mean, all the information is there in the web, if you watch Watson beat the Jeopardy champions, you sort of have this idea that who's going to need a smart doctor anymore. But maybe that's going to be true 50 years from now, but 10 years from now, I'm pretty confident that you're going to want your doctor to understand how to use the web and use the computer to get information, but also much of the time to have a pretty good font of information uh, between his or her ears.